Mumbles Pier is a grade 2 listed structure, 835 feet or 255 meters long, built in the Victorian period. In 1889, the Mumbles Railway and Pier Company was formed to lay a line, one mile and 22 chains long, from Oystermouth to Mumbles Head and to construct a pier. In 1889, the construction of Mumbles Pier began and was carried out by the seasoned pier specialists Mayo and Haley, overseen by the engineer W. S. Marsh. The pier was designed by W. Sutcliffe Marsh and promoted by John Jones Jenkins of the Rhonda and Swansea Bay Railway and it opened on 10 May 1898 at a cost of £10,000. It was the western terminus for the world's first passenger-carrying horse car railway the Swansea and Mumbles Railway, and a major terminal for the white funnel paddle steamers of P. and A. Campbell, carrying tourists from routes along the River Severn and Bristol Channel. The iron work was produced by the Wigness Foundry and much of their work is still present today, in particular the cast iron legs. The pier opened to members of the public on 10 May 1898. The summer of 1899, saw a long-running concert party on the pier organized by Will C. Pepper, father of the musicians Harry S. Pepper and Dick Pepper. The pier was not intended to be a traditional pleasure pier but was designed primarily to help alleviate congestion at the nearby Swansea docks as at this time Swansea was importing vast quantities of copper ore and exporting finished metals all over the world. However the competition was not appreciated by the docks and the pier became a solely recreational pier only a few years after opening. Amusement Equipment Company acquired a lease on the pier and foreshore around 1937 later taking the freehold interest and continue to operate the pier and surrounding businesses to this day. The pier closed on 1 October 1987 for a £40,000 refit which included renewal of the steel around the entrance. The pier reopened on Good Friday, 1988. During a major renovation in 2012, a new lifeboat station and RNLI gift shop was built at the end of the pier and also fishing platforms added. An entertainment complex at the pier includes a cafe and amusement arcade.